The Philadelphia City Planning Commission is suggesting plans to rejuvenate businesses in the area, especially the ones at Cotman and the Boulevard. Um, like all shopping centers, it needs to figure out how to evolve, how to be able to compete for new tenants and new customers. The population of the area is changing, uh, retail patterns are changing. So we're trying to uh, articulate a series of steps, starting with short-term steps, maybe dealing with some beautification, some streetscape improvements, uh, to create a, a better front door. So there's areas there that are not that inviting to walk around, so if they can do something to plant more trees, mask some of that stuff maybe, or you know, make it more attractive, that would be a big help. However, it's not just about making it more beautiful. David Ortiz, a senior planner, says it's also about making it more pedestrian friendly as well. We're suggesting uh, maybe a parking garage um, that can accommodate some parking, um, but also create some green on top of it so it would be underground, the parking garage, and then uh, some space for people to use um, while they're shopping, some passive recreation space. Um, we're suggesting uh, improvements to the interior of the parking lots um, so pedestrians can walk from the sidewalk um, through the lot into the stores. The Philadelphia City Planning Commission is still in the process of receiving feedback from the community and some people feel that the plans don't take everything into consideration. You can renovate buildings, you can renovate office space, you can renovate the Roosevelt Mall, but it's not going to bring people like myself out to a mall or to businesses if the streets aren't safe. This is Kayla Devin reporting for Philadelphia Neighborhoods.